Vive Streaming's performance can be affected by a number of factors. Here are some tips to optimize your wireless streaming experience for smooth, enjoyable VR sessions. Max out your graphics card. If your computer has an NVIDIA graphics card, make sure Power Management Mode on the NVIDIA Control Panel is set to Prefer Maximum Performance. Make sure your play area is big enough. If you're constantly hitting your play area's boundary, you'll experience dropped frames. Expand your play area's boundary if needed. Reduce traffic on your wireless router. Set up a dedicated wireless router for your headset and PC, and don't use any streaming services or other devices connected to the network. Switch your Wi-Fi router to a channel that has less overlap with other Wi-Fi access points. There are also a couple of things you can do in Vive Streaming Hub if you encounter performance hiccups. In Vive Streaming Hub, set streaming graphic preferences to performance. This will help make your streaming session a bit smoother. The streaming bitrate of your VR session may be too high for your network's bandwidth. Lower the bitrate and enable dynamic bitrate. When using a VR-ready laptop, plug your laptop into a power outlet. If your laptop has an NVIDIA graphics card, set Preferred Graphics Processor to High Performance NVIDIA Processor. Keep your laptop nice and cool. Lastly, if you want to share what you're seeing in VR with friends and family, ask them to watch on the computer monitor instead of casting your screen to another display. Screencasting during a wireless streaming session can affect streaming performance. These are just some things to keep in mind if you encounter performance issues while streaming. For more tips and information about Vive Streaming, you can always check out the Vive Streaming support site.